must have run out of doctors. It's an extension ladder. Some poor bastard took a spill. Yeah, looks like whoever was up here painting that sign went ass over tea kettle. I bet that hurt like hell. He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. Just need to figure out a way to get there. Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We can't stop looking out for each other. You two have been solid since day one. What's this, day three? Four? Well, I appreciate it. Allergies. Shit. People used to get those. I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with hay fever. It's not the time to get wistful. I know. It's this deal with Clem. It's everything. It's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies, too, and just... Fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you gonna be able to hang in there? I have to. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital, it won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Hmm. Yeah. That could help. Hey. How's the leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. Even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, too. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Yeah. Don't worry more than you should about her, okay? I think you're Clem's favorite, you know that? Really? Yeah, she's a big fan. You get away with shit I never would. We're getting her back, Lee. You know that, right? Yeah. When we get this fucker, we'll get out of sight and leave you with him. You get me? I get you. See anything? There's a fire escape here, and that's about it. You came with me. You didn't think I would? Just with all we've been through, it seemed like the only reasonable thing to do. You still want to die? I'm more afraid of getting someone else killed. Make sure that doesn't happen, as well as I can. Thanks. I including me? Getting bitten's not that bad. Really? No. It's a death sentence. It's horrible. But try not to worry about it. 
If we use that bell tower to lure all those walkers towards that side of the hospital, the road to the mansion and River Street shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, okay. But you still have to get over there. What do you think? I think I'm staring down at my worst nightmare. Just a dusty haze of death. Try to keep your shit together. I need to get off this roof. That looks like Crawford Square over there. Fuck that place. Did fix up our boat, though. We get Clementine and get right back. Make sure she wears her life jacket, okay? Something tells me she's not gonna want to. That looks like Crawford Square over there. See anything? Nah, I'm just, uh... I was taking a minute, actually. Sorry, I, I know I shouldn't. What's going on? That's just... everything. Fuck, man. You know. I do. I can't thank you enough for what you did for Duck. I don't know how I'd be if you hadn't. Don't dwell on it. I look at where we are. Right now. And I can't imagine Cat and Duck in all this mess. Kid. No. No, I I'm sorry. We're in a fucking hurry to get off this roof. It's... it's not the time. I'm sorry. I'm okay. How many you think are wandering around underneath us right now? In the hospital? Thousands. I mean, who knows? It was full of dead before, right? Yeah. That's what I was thinking. And out there? Look at that dust. Fuck, man, who knows? The mansion's that way. Bell Tower's over there. If we go down the opposite side of the roof, we might be able to make it without too much trouble. I can do that, yeah. Any thoughts about anything else? Nah, I'm all right. Just needed to take a second. I'll keep an eye out over here. Sorry. Here's a way down. Yeah, if half the dead population of Georgia wouldn't wander in the streets down there. Hey, I'll see if we can make it out to that bell tower. Okay, be careful though. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. Thanks. No way. It's higher than this roof for starters. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it. Damn it. Buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. I'll do it. Yeah, Ben will do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then.
Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time? Yep. I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit. Try to find another way out of there? It's locked. Shit. The exit in here's locked! A few solid rings of this, and there'll be thousands down below. way tons of them jesus now get back here i think i have to jump there's no way back you can make it it ain't that far This motherfucker. <sighs> Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof! Come the fuck on! Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. Who? Fuck. How could this happen? It's a guy on the radio, the one that's got Clem. They're gone. Holy shit, they're gone. Relax. Hey, guys. No, it wasn't the guy on the radio. It was Vernon. No fucking way! The invalids? Their actions uh, contradict your characterization, but... Yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their Make-A-Wish was a fucking boat ride! When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! I can't believe they did this to us. It's sick. It really is. They use your goddamn sympathy for sick folks and then stab us right in the back! They didn't use shit. They did what anybody would have done. They've been living like ghosts forever, and they were fed up. That's it. He says he feels bad about it. Leaving us, and Clementine behind. They fucked us! Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. 
Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Worry about the boat after. Can scour the goddamn coast looking for I'll make that bastard wish the cancer had got him. You're welcome to. Just calm down for a second. Yeah, chill. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? That wasn't the last boat in America. The idea was sound before, and it's sound now. The mainland is done. We have no idea what else is out there. Boats, to towns, hopes. Lee, people end up dead chasing impossible things. It'll be better than getting eaten alone. Out there. Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill. Lee's bitten and God knows how long he has left. Clementine is who the fuck knows, and we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny! Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katya and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse, and I don't know. So give me a fucking break. Oh, Ben, I'm... Oh, shit! Here they come! In the house! 